Hey Grey Dramas, hope you're doing well. Uh, today I'm coming to you with an exclusive single barrel bottling from the exclusive malts, uh, which is the whiskeybarrel.com. Make sure you check them out. Friends of Grey Drams, absolutely lovely people. And I love the bottle, that metal plate on there. Very nicely done. Um, but this is a <coughs> Lefroy six year old single cask. Uh, been stored in a refill sherry hogshead to celebrate their 10th anniversary and uh, yeah lovely colour to it absolutely lovely colour let's have a go now before I start this actually the uh, I should always explain it may be six years old but age is just a number as so many people advancing in years always say but the reality is that with whiskey if especially peated whiskey the younger kind of peated ones actually give off the more peat, the more kind of peat power as peat dissipates when it gets to about the 15 year mark right through to 25 and it hits that sweet spot of absolute perfection hence the Lefroy 25 being knockout um, and yeah so this is going to be packed with peat, huge punch of that smoky peaty Isla love all right let's have a go tons of burnt rubber and peat on the nose oh yeah an underlying kind of softness, vanilla note. I don't know how that vanilla's there, but it's, it's actually more the pods, not the actual kind of like vanilla ice cream. That rubber note, you can't get past it. Really, really nice. Really strong. And what you really want from a young, stunning Lefroy or Isla repeated whiskey. palette still got that rubber note to it. Um, so much time, I'm going to add some water and see what that does. Yeah, yeah, that's how planned I was for this. So, add a bit of water to it, just see what happens. Oof. Nose pretty much stays the same, rubbery, peaty, quite thick, quite smoky, quite Kind of, uh, you know, that grey black smoke that billows from a, a, a building that's on fire, for example, that kind of thing. It's filling my nose, filling my mouth, filling my lungs. Mm. Now, on the palate, it softens, reveals a few more kind of fruit notes. Mm. Got some deep, dark, kind of raisiny prunes. Ah, what else is there? A little bit biscuity, a bit of toffee, slightly vegetal but not too much. But that rubber note persists and a real kind of burning, burning ash, you know. Mm. Fantastic. Good medium spicy finish. Ooh, that's white pepper, cayenne, maybe a slight kind of a herbal note there as well and a pang of kind of uh, lemon citrus there. Beautiful. Really nicely done, guys. Well chosen. Cheers and congratulations on 10 years. Until next time, great dramas. Cheers.